uh, the question about you have million dollars, how do you invest your money? And this is a question we ask ourselves all the time. And like myself, I, I played stock market for 15 years. Uh, my banker probably sold me every single kind of product under the bank and I've tested it before for bonds, structured deals, notes, uh, insurance and the kind of insurance products you die, you get a lot of money or before you die, you also get a lot of money. <laughs> so we, we tested everything, right? So the big thinking, big thesis for this year is we believe that there will be a major shift of allocation between what you put into equities and what you put into digital assets. We call it cryptocurrencies. So I'm a big believer of cryptocurrencies. And we know it's just at the beginning. And the question is, is it 60, 40, 70, 30, 80, 20 allocation? <laughs> the way we see it is, uh, if you have a high appetite, risk appetite, then you look at something as a 10 bagger opportunity, and that's how we look at digital currencies. Equities is not going to give you that kind of returns that easily. Take for example, when Super Coffee Mix Super got acquired uh, two years ago, we knew about three months before the acquisition. How do we? How did we get to know this piece of information? You play with the spiking app. We see Sam Gui go Sam Gui. Eight consecutive purchase of super stocks. Da, 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 da. Literally every day, ramp up his purchase. By eight times, he stopped quiet for two months. We say, oh, old man got something up his sleeve already. Sam Gui, Popia King. Two months later, announcement. Company got acquired 1.5 billion or something like that. But the stock price only spiked up 50%. Only 50%. Today, you look at cryptocurrencies, Ethereum can move in one hour 100%, 80%. That, that's the big difference, man. The, the time frame to squeeze a spike, like a 10 bagger stock traditionally, back in uh, Wising time, to get a 10 bagger stock, probably waiting period between 5 to 10 years. Then, in the last decade, maybe squeeze down to 3 to 5 years. And Anil, who's playing FDA stocks, check out this. Two brothers called Baker Brothers, B A K E R. They are the expert playing pharmaceutical stocks, FDA approved stocks. Their return 1000% takes about two to three years. They squeeze that even further down, right? So, right now, if you look at digital currency, they squeeze that even further down to like within one month to one year. <laughs> so, we are trying to look at how to squeeze that further to get more returns, but again, end of the day, it really depends on your risk appetite and how much war chess you have to play in the market.